Action! Hey guys, I'm back again. Matt's not here this time, but I'm here and I'm going to be showing you a tutorial on how I get the speedsters flash effect and speed effect. So first of all I'll show you some um some examples of that. Racy there, I could beat him. So it's fairly simple. Basically the two apps that you need are iMovie, that one right there, and stop motion. So first app I'll be using is stop motion. Okay. So now I'm on to a new so just to get into it you press new movie and then there you are so that has a camera um, and you take pictures basically and you go into frames per second and do it the highest it can so up to about 30 frames per second. I don't know if you can see it properly, but yeah, there we go. So 30 frames per second. And then you start taking pictures. So basically you just want to get a stool for your iPad to stand on. And then what you do is you go into this little clock here and it's a timer and you do five seconds. So this is only by yourself. If you're not by yourself, then you can just get whoever else is filming to take the pictures for you. But um, I've put it onto a timer for five seconds. Don't do it any um, longer because then it just won't take what you need to get. Um, yeah, so because there's no one else here. So um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to press the play button and then look there's a timer and it will take a picture now and then you get in your position and start running basically I'll just turn that off so I can keep on talking um, you get in your position and start running um, so basically um, you just like get in the position like this or something and then as the five seconds goes along, you just run really slowly and it will take pictures automatically. So I'll show you what it looks like when it's done. So now that's done, it's just really fast of me running over and over. So I just run from one side of the room to the other quite slowly. And the outcome is me running from one side of the room really fast. And yeah. So now what you want to do is make the streaks or lightning bolts or whatever you want to call them. So you press on the frame and you go into draw. So on draw, you pick the colour or um, what, what colour your streak is going to be. I've chosen red, but you can choose whatever colour you want. And basically, you just draw behind um, the person. So do as many as you feel necessary and then you go back and you do the exact same thing to all the others okay so once you've done that now look what that looks like so that looks a lot more like the flash. I mean, it's like not perfect, but as I said, you want to go for Adobe After Effects or Final Cut if you want to get better results. But basically, once you've done that, you go out and you go Export Movie. And then go Save Video. I usually just do that one because that one's probably the best one. That doesn't always work for me for some reason, but yep. So basically, now you just go on to iMovie. And once you're on there, it's just loading. Um, so once you're on there, 
you just basically go on to movie, new movie, and you select it. It's here. And you press create movie. Um, and then there it is. It's really fast, but there is your lightning effect and your speed effect. So now you can add it to other films and yeah. So that is all. Thank you for listening to my tutorial. I will do more when I do other videos that have effects in them. And yeah, that's all.